Hey, welcome back to White Mountains Today. I'm Dave Cowley. I'm joined in studio with Lori Dyer. Lori, thank you so much for joining us. You are the uh, artist in residence for the National Forest this year, yes, correct? Sir. Mm -hmm. Awesome. So can you tell us a little bit about what that entails? Sure. So um, it's a partnership between the White Mountain National Forest and the um, Art Alliance of Northern New Hampshire. Mm -hmm. And um, it's a way to get people to use the forest and to celebrate the art within it. So this year it's their centennial, which is pretty amazing. Right. So I'm really honored to represent since I'm from LA. Mm -hmm. and. Um, so that's basically what it is, and I come for three to four weeks. This uh, year I'm, I'm the artist doing four weeks, and right. I basically One do, extra week. Yeah, extra week. That's mm -hmm. a lot of work, what I'm doing. So um, I take daily walks through the forest mm -hmm. and document what I noticed. I'm c assembling a field guide to the unnoticed. Right, that's awesome. So, um, that's really cool. Yeah, and then How I created a website um, for everyone else's voice. So, because um, I, I really want, um, it's, the cool thing about the forest is that um, it's not like a national park, right? Mm -hmm. The forest is used and right. um, all the towns are all around it. So I really wanted to have the voice of the people. So I created an online website for that. Right. And you can go there and upload photos and stuff like that as yep. well to the, right. Yep. So kind of contribute song. your story. It doesn't have to be just photos. Yeah. No, sing a song, write a poem. Um, basically, anytime you're in the forest, just take a picture. Well, it has to be in the end a document somehow to post. Um, to the right. website. And the website is um, unnoticed uh, fieldguide wmnf.com. Right, White Mountains National yeah. Forest. Yes. Perfect. Awesome. Mm -hmm. How did you find yourself doing this? Um, it's kind of an interesting lineage because you're from, well, you grew up in Massachusetts. You went to LA and now yeah. you're back here. Yes. Uh, how did you find yourself from LA to the National Forest? Actually, my mother sent me the residency application, which I thought was pretty awesome. Nice. Oh, and mom I'm, coming through. Yeah, and I'm driving her a big, crazy Crown Vic through these little bitty roads, <laughs> which is also funny. That's awesome. <laughs> Terrifying the other day on El on Sandwich Notch Road. Oh man, that is I not was where going one of those. Should one be. <laughs> mile an hour, but I got to the most awesome trail, El Gonquin Trail. So that was great. Mm -hmm. um, so I just really I wanted to take a break from the chaos of LA. Mm -hmm. And it's all my work is about noticing. So I thought I'm an urban artist, so I do it in the city. Mm -hmm. So I thought, wouldn't it be great to do what I do in the forest? So I'm noticing really creepy trees and <laughs> <laughs> weird colors, and it's pretty awesome. So, right. um, and then I kind of have fun with the with the titles and sort right. of sort of get people to see things kind of a different way. Mm -hmm. Like we all know it's a mushroom, but maybe it could be something else too. Right. Um, Those angles. A little bit of like, what do you see in the cloud in the sky? Sort mm -hmm. of. Something right. Like that. That's really yeah. cool. Do you have a, it's kind of a loaded question, but do you have a favorite aspect or a favorite part of, of this job? Because it's, it's such um, a unique job. There's a lot, lot to talk about. Yeah. Okay. Well, the rain has been really interesting to my hair. <laughs> it's like a barometer of the weather. Right. We um, actually use that for the morning show. Oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I, I mean, obviously getting four or five hours a day to just walk and have that kind of meditative thing is really wonderful. Um, mm -hmm. Meeting the people when I do see the people is really interesting and never be a single woman with headphones in <laughs> <laughs> and stand up and have a gentleman standing there with a hacksaw and a, a, a hatchet <laughs> who is cleaning Whoa. the trails up above and I screamed, <laughs> of course. Mm -hmm. So, but I really just be, just, I love being able to have that luxury of the walk and to be able to celebrate, um, you know, the forest hundred years and right. to be able to really embrace that. I want to say a big part of what I wanted to do was to give the forest staff a voice because mm -hmm. they're kind of in the front lines of right. sort of in the forest, seeing it in the off, in, either in the office or seeing it on the site. Right. And so I created this website to give them kind of a place to talk about what they do. So cool. hopefully you guys will be able to learn kind of all the stories that they have, and they have very interesting stories. I'm sure, yeah, they're yeah. definitely busy up there. There's so much going on. There's so many yeah. visitors too, so I'm sure they have, you know, they have to deal with not just people coming in, but also managing, you know, there's parking and there's all these other crazy parts of a forest. Yep, that yep, have logging. To exist. I'm actually walking with an archaeologist. 
mm -hmm. um, pretty soon. And cool. then I'm hoping to also walk with um, somebody from Timber for logging to mm -hmm. kind of see sort of a public person, sort of what they do with the forest. Right, how they go through. Yeah. That's really cool. When you, yeah. So when you bring your, your camera, you were saying that you're an artist, not a photographer, but you use yeah. photography as a more tool. Yep. What do you look for when you're capturing images? Okay, well, so it's all about noticing. So sometimes I'm working really hard to sort of be present and notice. Oh, I should tell you about John Muir. You know okay. John Muir? Oh, yeah, of course. He's like the god mm -hmm. in um, California, in Western um, U.S. So mm -hmm. he hated hiking, <laughs> and he hated hikers. Mm -hmm. Do you know about this? I, I know a little bit about okay. this, Okay, yeah. and so he was called, um, he said everyone should saunter, and so that's kind of how I do my walks. I sort of never get to the top. I stop, am I there yet? And they're like, hardly. I'm like, oh. <laughs> and so, because I get so kind of distracted, we meander. Mm -hmm. So uh, we just did a walk, an artist walk, and we have one coming up on, on Monday. At, it's at Lincoln Woods Cabin, mm -hmm. uh, Monday at 10 o'clock. So Perfect. it's open for everyone. You don't have to be an expert. Please come, um, mm -hmm. bring your camera, your cell phone to our sketch pad or anything, and we just take a very slow walk. So John uh, Muir said that, um, Years ago, the Middle Ages, people would um, walk to the Holy Lands, and mm -hmm. the villagers would say, "What are you? Um, what are you doing?" And they would say, "A la santé, we're going to the Holy Land." Right. So they got to be known as the Santerers, oh. and so that's how it's Santerers. Oh, yeah. And so okay. I really feel like that's what we should be doing. We should be like celebrating the majestic of the forest, and so I will kind of wander through the forest, and um, I'll just sometimes stop and just just look at something for right. a long time. And sometimes I'm sort of storming off, I'm never gonna see anything, I'm never gonna see anything, and then bam, something shows up. Right, it just happens all of a sudden out of the blue, yeah. awesome. When, when is that yeah. walk again that you're So the walk hosting? is Monday, two mm -hmm. days, the 30th um, at 10 o'clock at Lincoln Woods Cabin. Lincoln Woods Cabin. Which is okay. um, at the trailhead, and uh, we just have to meet right there at the cabin, and we'll do a, walk, a talk, and then we walk, and then we come back and we share and do, um, some reflection on what happened. It was really cool. fun. The last one was amazing. The people were so creative. Nice. That's awesome. Yeah. It's really cool. So two days from now, Lincoln Woods Cabin. Two days from now. And then there's also um, a last artist talk on August 9th mm -hmm. at 6.30. Um, I'm pretty sure it's at the National Forest, but we're not, um, the bureau there, the office is okay. in Campton. But right. Um, it, anyway, but that's August 9th, and you can go to the Art Alliance of New ha of New Ham uh, Northern New Hampshire, mm -hmm. AANNH, to get all the information. Nice. Okay, cool, great. Yeah. yeah, check that out. That's awesome. And then okay. at the are you end of... Give me a, are you going to give me a photo? Are you going to post? <laughs> yeah, I, might, I, I could do that. I walk through forests all the time. Okay. Yeah, I do saunter a lot, too. I like that. Now I can use that instead of being like, oh, yeah. just, I'm just too out of shape to go to the top. And that's not true. I'm just... The other day instead. when we were walking, that's a perfect example, um, I was talking to the group and these people mm -hmm. zip past and I said, hikers. hikers. <laughs> <laughs> My son and husband uh, just did Whitney, hiked for seven mm -hmm. days. He's, Ooh, a, yeah, he's nice. an almost eagle scout and mm -hmm. they are like treadmill in nature, like mm -hmm. book to the top. Yeah, as and fast as you can like, possibly wait, go. And I'm like, wait, look at this over here, smell this, listen mm -hmm. to that sound. So Yeah, it's incredible what you find once you look around a little bit. Yeah. You know, yeah, and there's the website over there. You can take a look, I guess not over there. On your screen, there's the website. Yeah. You can take a look mm -hmm. at it. And there's awesome. that little green button right there next to the gray, and uh, you can just post, sign up and post. And, awesome, uh, so anyone can go on there and yeah. submit and contribute. Yeah, and actually, that one, um, these are some of the people that posted, and um, one on my website it says, I'm busy turning away from the vistas and mm -hmm. noticing the smaller parts of the forest. Right. So, because New Hampshire is so stunning, mm -hmm. and I felt like that's really been covered, the sort of, the, the vistas, landscape. the grand landscapes, mm -hmm. right? And so these sort of tiny, sort of what people notice, mm -hmm. I think really important, so. Right, cool. And yeah. then you're at, at the very end of all of this, you're actually assembling a field guide to the unnoticed? Yes, I'm doing, thank you. I'm also doing a, a book. Mm -hmm. um, the, the website is really for people's um, voice to be heard for everyone. And I'm on there also, but it's for others as well. So. Right. And then, but the book is my um, kind of take on it. And so there'll be, it'll be just like a field guide. There'll be um, illustrations and anecdotes and assessing of the forest. But my art right. is pretty whimsical, so it will be um, kind of, uh, I think, a little playful. Right. It'll be a, a different kind of field guide. So it's called a field guide to the unnoticed. Right. Cool. Awesome. Well, thank you very much. Is there anything else that I missed there? Or? 
Were you able to no. cover everything? Um, yep, just, uh, nope, that's it. Just the, the walk is on Monday, um, 10 o'clock at Lincoln Woods Cabin. And then there's also an artist talk August 9th. Mm -hmm. at 6.30. And you can check out all of this um, on the Art Alliance website. It's Art Alliance of Northern New Hampshire, and they'll have all the information there. Perfect. Awesome. Well, that's Lori Dyer, the artist in residence for the White Mountain National Forest. Thank you so much for chatting with us. Thank you. That was awesome. I'll have to go oh. on there and submit a picture. Oh, yeah. Throw can it in. Can I just do a shout out to Mead Base? Thank you very much. I've been staying there for a couple of weeks, and they're great. And my awesome. roommates are all... Uh, trail workers from AmeriCorps and oh, they're cool. working their butts off. Right. So. so not just do you spend your days there, you also spend your nights. Yeah, you chatting you're away really, people. You're fully immersed there. I am, yes. That's awesome. Lori Thank Dyer, you. artist in residence. We'll be right back with White Mountains today. Stay with us. Thank you.